Hey everyone, this is Gabriela Garza with your news update. A child at the center of a murder case is now in the temporary care of a relative. The two-year-old's great-grandmother, Elizabeth Guerrero, is charged with murder. She allegedly ran the father of the child, Gilbert Gaitan, over with a car. This week, Child Protective Services put the child in temporary custody of a relative. The mother of the child, who was in the car when Guerrero allegedly struck Gaitan, was ordered to stay away from the toddler. A man suspected of shooting a DPS trooper to death in East Texas remains hospitalized. 32-year-old DeBrett Black was arrested following a police chase last night in Waller County. He's accused of killing 41-year-old Damon Allen, a 15-year veteran of the DPS. And a new system will help veterans get faster answers on their benefit claims disagreements. It's called the Rapid Repeals Modernization Program, also known as RAMP. RAMP is part of a new law, the Veterans Appeals Improvement and Modernization Act of 2017. Right now, the program is voluntary. All requests for a claims review decision will go through the RAMP program starting in February. Your forecast today is sunny skies, a warmer afternoon, temperatures in the upper 70s. That's it for your news update for Friday, November 24th. Have a great weekend.